Assalamualaikum everyone. Hope all are doing good. Actually, in this block have five room. One room, uh, leave two students. This is the room number one, two, and three. Other side have room number four and room number five. Here have one a small kitchen. People can wash their dishes wisely and here have one basin this place is for hanging the clothes and it's the main interior for room one room have two beds two tables and two cabinet this is the outside view as you can see it's very good environment now I will turn in the washroom section this is the washroom area now I am going to the next local student block this is the outside of architecture All people can use this area for drying the clothes. This is the corridor for a student. Here I have one information board for all students. Now I will turn the room section. This is the inside of the room. Actually, this portion for a student can leave one room. Here I have a small cabinet for a study tables as well. So now I will show the outside view of this block. This is the outside view. So now I am going for next tip. This is the inside of cabinet. A small cabinet. People can keep their clothes organizedly. Now I am showing the next washroom area. This is the washroom area. All blocks made can use one washroom. Here have separate shower area and toilets. So this is the outside view of this hostel. Now I am going to share international student blog for female. This is the main entrance for international students. They are living here. Here have a small portion. The students are planting here. This living room have one mini sofa. And here have five rooms for living. As I saw you before.
Now I'll share the inside of the room. Actually, one room has two people. Here has one a small cabinet, a study table, and bed. This is the outside view of this hostel. Here have other portion for another person. This side have a study table. So that's all for me, and thank you for watching my video. Bye bye and take care. See you in the next.